Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. How are you doing? Hope you all are doing well and staying safe. Today I'm going to talk about soil formation. So let's get started. We all know soil is the loose surface material that covers most land. Soil is a mixture of liquids, organic matter, gases, minerals and organisms. But have you ever thought how soil is formed? Well, formation of soil starts with chemical and physical breakdown of the earth's rocks caused by atmospheric agents. Soil formation process is known as weathering. Weathering it takes place as rocks are broken down into progressively smaller pieces by the efforts of weather. Soil can be formed by three processes. They are mechanical weathering, chemical weathering, and biological weathering. Now let's see what is mechanical weathering. Mechanical weathering is also called physical weathering and disaggregation. Mechanical weathering is the process of breaking big rocks into little ones. This process usually happens near the surface of the planet. The key agent of mechanical weathering is water in solid and liquid form. Temperature scenes contribute to physical weathering through a process known as terminal stress. The structure of rock weakens when the temperature keeps swinging between hot and cold temperatures. When the temperature is cold, the rocks contract, and when the temperature is hot, the rocks expand. This results in weakening of the rock structure. Now let's see what is chemical weathering. Chemical weathering is a cause when rocks are broken down by chemical reaction. This reaction include oxidation, hydrolysis, and carbonation. In the carbonation process, the softer rocks are dissolved when water reacts with carbon dioxide, resulting in the creation of carbonic acid. Water acids, oxygen are just a few of the chemicals that lead to geological scenes. Let's see what is biological weathering. Biological weathering is caused by the action of plants and animals as they grow nest in burrow. The lichens growing on the rocks discharge creation chemicals that break down the rocks into a fine powder and form a thin layer of soil. The masses also develop on the rock surface and further break the rock. The roots of the trees get into the cracks of rocks and push them to within thereby breaking the rocks. Rocks and sediment are turned into soils when they are chemically attracted by the carbonic acid which is formed due to the respiration of carbon dioxide by plant roots. Thank you for listening to me. If you love this video, please do like, comment, share and subscribe to my channel. So stay happy, keep smiling, spread kindness. Bye-bye.